So, yes, heat will kill mold. Um, the USDA, which is in charge of our food, says that um, temperatures between 140 and 160 degrees Fahrenheit will kill most mold spores. Um, now, there's certain types of mold spores that are not found in any kind of building material. They are found in food uh, that it will kill. Uh, but the USDA does say that um, heat will kill mold um, above 140 degrees Fahrenheit. Now, now, heat can also be used to kill mold on building materials. It's not just limited to food. But here's the thing, you know, killing mold is not necessarily, you know, the number one go-to, especially on porous building materials. Um, dead mold can affect you just as much as living mold. So, you know, just killing the mold is not really going to be your your top bet. You're, you're going to want to have the mold removed, whether it be from mold remediation or if it's something less than 10 square feet, you can kind of um, remove it yourself. It's just because, it, you know, it's not going to get rid of the, the mold. It's still going to be there. And another problem with heat is that if, if you're using some kind of blower um, to get the heat out on the building material, it's going to be blowing the mold spores. If you don't have a containment barrier up, it's going to blow the mold spores basically all over the home. Um, and if you are using a containment barrier, the problem with that is that it's mostly made of plastic and extreme heat can maybe let off chemicals from the plastic. So you really got to be careful what you use for a containment barrier. Uh, long story short, if you have a better option than heat, I would say use it because, you know, it, it, while it does kill mold, it's just it's not going to be your best bet. So listen, if you know, if you wanted to kill mold, if that is your objective, which again is, you know, not your best bet, you have other things that can kill mold. You have hydrogen peroxide, you have a fungicide, you have a biocide, something like a bleach, although you don't want to use bleach on uh, you know, porous build, building materials, just kind of on non-porous building materials. Um, even white vinegar has been known to kill a lot of different types of uh, uh, mold. So there's other methods you can use to kill mold outside of heat. The one thing about heat that, that's good is that there is no kind of chemical in heat. It's, uh, it's just straight natural. So that's where it does have an advantage over using any kind of harsh chemicals. If you enjoyed this video and want to learn more about mold, go to lookmold.com. And please don't forget to subscribe to the channel.